Okay, now that we actually created uh, uh, an application, uh, um, a project, and uh, we create a file in it, and it file is doing something. Let's say I want to take this uh, program off my computer, go to another computer that has Visual Studio, and open this. To do that, you don't need to carry all the files that it has. As a matter of fact, because this Visual Studio is a very complicated thing, it's going to create so many different files that you don't need for a simple console application. What you need to carry around with this, I'm going to show it to you. So go to the directory that you have the um, the, uh, the project in. So right click on the project then select open file in file explorer. So this is the place. The only things you need to create is the file that you created, the name of the project VCS Proj, and the name of the project VCS filter, uh, VCS Proj filter. These three files. So if you had five C files, you need all the five C files. But the only files to, to, that you need to carry around to carry the uh, project with you are these two files. These two files, VCX Proj and VCX Proj filters, hold all the organization that you have inside your project. So that's it. So I'm going to copy this and I'm going to go in IPC144, create a directory. I'm going to say copy of demo just to show you what does it mean and I'm going to paste it right over there. So as you see in this one I only have these three. If you look at the other one there are lots of stuff debug.vs and many things solution. So I'm going to close this, close Visual Studio. All right. And go back to copy of demo and all I need to do is to double click on demo VCX proj. It's going to tell me what you want to open this for. I'm going to say open with Visual Studio 2017. Always lose this app. And I'm going to click on OK. And now it's going to open Visual Studio. And you will see that the Solution Explorer is here. There we go. We have the Solution Explorer and the file MyCProj. I'll go debug. Start without debugging. It will compile the file and run it exactly as we left it. Give it a second and here you are. Alright, now if you look at it you'll see everything is in place. If you open this you will see that that's exactly how you left it.